All right, this is Hamam at the owner of Sun Shield right here. Good no. guy. <laughs> Lowe's Law Celebrity, so hopefully uh, we'll get our car in good shape here. We got the Tesla Model 3, we're getting the XR Plus uh, put on. So it's going to be excellent. So we're going to do the whole front and everything. Uh, he recommends 70% because, again, it's not going to be so, uh, well, nothing's really legal front, really, to be honest with you. But it's a little bit more visible, and it still give you the best. Now, there's also 80% too, that he was just telling me right here. This is where the guys have right here. So that's Hama and his crew right there. Pretty neat. They're working on this. Wow, they got another car in already. That was quick. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> so this is, uh, you're talking about 80%, and this is the 70% one. And it goes further down. So the lower the number, the more darker it is. So when you have limo tint, limo tints are mostly like 15 to 5%. This is really dark right here. And then there's a CS, and then there's a nano ceramic coating. Show me a difference. Even though this is darker uh, versus the ceramic coating nano, this one actually have lesser heat. Now, when you're talking about raw, you see when it's raw also. That's actually the hottest right there. Let's put my finger in there. Let me see if I can do it while pushing the button here. It's going to be harder because I'm the only one that's holding the camera. And I'm not sure if I can do it now. Let's see if I can do it like this way. Always there's a way, there's a will, right? So I'm going to push the button here, sorry. There you go, wow, it's hot. Flaming hot right there. Okay, now this is just uh, pretty much ceramic. Not even nano yet. A little bit better. And then when you get into the lighter one here, you guys can see I'm going to push it all the way. Do it again. That way you guys can see it. Oh. Go ahead and get in there. There we go. Not bad. Much more cooler effect. So I can't wait. Looking forward to it. It looks like he has a clean setup. He actually has a gal working too, as well as a couple of guys. So not pretty good. He looks like he knows what he's doing. Yes, right here. I recommend for your window tinting, come down. Southern California is worth the drive. He does it for a very reasonable price. I mean, super fair for the quality of work he put into it. I think you can get the whole front of your whole Tesla Model 3 wrapped and everything for like less than 760. And that's using XR Plus, the best of the best. So check them out over here at SunShield uh, Window Tint. They're Expel authorized dealer. Been doing it for 30 plus years. Okay, maybe that's not for my car. That's for the one for the rear. Uh, I guess he's working in my car here. So that's weird. I would think my windshield is a little bit bigger than that little small piece. But I guess maybe they're doing something with it. We'll find out. Interesting, very interesting. Interesting. Small little piece, huh? How is that going to cover my whole windshield? That doesn't even look like it quite covers 10% of it. Or a quarter of it, let's say. But maybe it's for some different panels. Oh wow, look at that. There it is. Look. See me doing it. Oh wow, I didn't know that. That puts it for the beam. Interesting, huh? How they make it like that. Oh, oh, that's probably just to protect the, the water from splashing into it. Look how nice they take care of everything. They put it into... That's just to protect the water from not damaging the side of the panels. So that's pretty smart of them. Look at that. So almost, almost like a workspace. Very professional. I can't tell by the front here. So I guess he's just making a little side panel so it won't damage the front. I guess they know what they're doing. This is their first rodeo. Very cool. Huh. They use the heat gun and everything. Well, he tapes it up so he protects it from getting dirty. That's, he just needs the windshield thing to protect it. Amazing. That's just to protect it from getting dirty, huh? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was going to be a two, three piece. <laughs> there he is. He's going to do another side as well. You'll follow up here.
Just that prep work, just protect the pillars, the A pillar inside from getting dirty. Because once it hits a whole bunch of splashes, it's not going back. Now I'm going to have some cooler, much cooler window after all this is said and done. I didn't realize he just actually brought over my windshield. Look how big that sucker is. I'm not sure it took the whole glass here, but he's preparing for it. So, unless it's already been put on. So we'll find out how it looks. Oh, he's already got the heat gun to it. That means he already took it off already. That was fast. I didn't see him see it. So that's pretty nice. It's got a heat gun to it already. I think he's right now he's pre-measuring it on the exterior of the car. He's putting heat gun to it. I guess they do trace it on the very top and then they'll lay it inside. So the window tint is always on the inside, not the outside. Got started and going on the inside now. Pretty neat. Oh man, look at all that water in my dash. I guess that's part of it. They got this little rag thing too to protect it though. So it's kind of nice. One of them is watching it, the other one's doing it. Pretty neat. My, my dry, I'll drive back home much more cooler now. Very nice enough to show me some of the rock chips that were already there at the time. So he just wants to point it out for me. So these guys really take extra care and pointing out so you can see here these are all the rock ships originally were there already and then there was one here he marked it with a big line look kind of white so too bad they can't get it off unfortunately so all right guys do an excellent job <laughs> so again i'm gonna go wait on the waiting room let these guys do a thing i'm your last one today yes sir oh man sorry to hold you guys back all right so this is it so hopefully you'll get that all down the way See, they got a whole team there. Gosh, cleaning it was like almost an hour just to prep it. I didn't realize these guys really do make their money. So, hopefully we'll get all squared away. She's got the inside dash. She's working on it right now. You put the film in there yet or no? Oh, it is in there already? There it is, you guys. Pretty neat. Fast. I already got the film in there. Yeah, but we need a little bit more time for a detail. Oh, yeah, yeah, don't worry. Take your time. The taco can wait. <laughs> I just want to make sure. I was told him I was going to get Korean tacos after this, but I'd rather have to make sure the car is good condition before I drive it back home. So I'll be more than happy. Hamad's a nice guy. I think he's got some kind of thing. I thought it was sciatic nerve, like me walking funny, but he probably has more of a... He's just admiring the other person's work here. They didn't even know how to line the window, huh? Yeah, Pretty choppy. The cut is bad. Yeah. Oh, you can actually trim it? Oh, look at this. Look at that. Hamad took care of me. See, that's all they had to really do. This guy didn't know what he's doing. You might get a close up of what you're doing? Okay, look at this. This is how a really good window shop would take care of you, even though they're not responsible for it. You see, it got even. Look at that. Much better. It looks so much cleaner. I didn't even know you can even fix it afterward. Oh, look, he even knows a trick. You can click here. Much better. It's not perfect as you would have done it if it was yeah, from you originally. I just shot but it's so it much better. Here. Yeah, before it was like choppy right there in that little corner, huh? You see, it's too deep. Yeah, it's too deep. Go. You can't go there anymore. Yeah. But he did the best he can with that one. Look at that. Wow, you got a lot of access of one, huh? And it doesn't hurt the window at all. No. Look at that, you guys. This is Hamid, the owner of Sunshield. You guys, come to Sherman Oaks. We're in Van Nuys, or is this that part of LA? It's the Sherman Oaks. Oh, okay. Oh, he's gotta go. Hopefully, that one looks good too. 
uh, he takes care of his customers. So hopefully we get to see him in action again. I'm kind of <laughs> the rest of it for you too. No worry, you're a multitasker. <laughs> I guess all of his staff here have been working here for almost 14, 10 plus years. Some one of them was like 14 plus years. I can't believe how long he worked. Yeah, he's still going at it, even on the phone. Amazing. Nothing that ever leaves this guy's sight. Lifetime warranty against Amazing. Hi. Yeah, he didn't have to do this, but he did it for me anyway. Check this out. Look at that. He's straightening it up right now. Which day is good for you? Of course, my time is better for you. Wow. Yeah, Hamid here in the house. Yeah, here in the house. Oh, sorry, am I blocking you? That was a trick to it. <laughs> yeah. Much yeah, better now. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I was surprised. <laughs> I guess he doesn't like imperfection as well. So I got a little bit more than I asked for actually. He charged me a very fair amount just to do the front for me. While well, he also corrected some of the back, cutting jabby edge. Couldn't take out the contaminants unfortunately. But that's the way it goes. See if he can do it. You can see here how it originally is right now. Look how bad. This is from Superior Window Tint guys. And this is the difference between the quality of workmanship to expect. Let me get on the whiteboard that way you can see how bad chickety edge is. See, see that? Very chickety edge. There's Hamad himself. He's gonna go and try to do it here. Very deep, huh? Oh, he's gonna try to cut it. Not even gonna waste his time to trim it. He's been with the company for 14 years. Wow, look at that line cut straight. Oh, look at that, beautiful. <laughs> From Sunshield, um, we're here at the Tahan Ranch again, my favorite spot here where the breeze is always nice. You see here, there's three white Tesla Model 3s just like mine and everything else is pre vacant. So let's see what the charge speed is on it, shall we? Um, I, I, I really like the, the windshield. I do see a little bit of an orange peel, but I think it'll go away. It's probably from uh, normal, not wiping it down entirely, but you can see how it gave it the car a nice little, I guess a little bit of a, what do you call that? A little bit of a tint, it's 70%. So it's gonna create a little bit of tint just to help block the UV a little bit. So kind of like nothing sticks under my thing. Look at this. Oh yeah, there you go. It sticks. <laughs> look at that, look at that guy. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Uh, it's charging. Oh gosh, cool. I got about 415 miles per hour here charged. So it's gonna be a while. We'll be here for a little bit. So in the meantime, I already got enough Korean tacos here to last me maybe until next year. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I got about maybe three more sets of uh, Korean taco left. I had a total of four, I think. I might ate three already and they were good. I told them to put the sauce on the side. They have two sauces on them. I didn't realize that they have like a sweet sauce that they put and marinate the, the beef with and then they give you the little side of hot sauce. You can see the final product here. I kid you not, it's really invisible glass. Oh my gosh, look at the visibility there. 
you can see there our house number and everything i'm not sure why i don't keep privacy but it doesn't really matter We're, we live in a small world people want to find you they'll find you regardless um so look how clear that is it's not amazing <laughs> Ooh, excuse me i do recommend getting it from here uh hamed you can see his name right on the very top there's his business card it's so much worth it you'll save almost self half of it if you go anywhere else and also you get quality workmanship just it's not about just pricing alone but the quality of an experience 30 plus years experience hamad's been doing this he's an iranian refuge who's pretty much an american success story here uh he opened his shop up employed dozens of people and he'll get your cart in and out quicker and with quality care he's such a nice guy he always looks after every customer a car I, I just watched him do his work um he has auspice not auspice process something i believe a polio there you go where he it affected him since he was a child and it, that's what caused him to limp a little bit i thought he had sciatic pain like i did but it wasn't that uh you can see here the breakdown of what you're getting here 650 he'll do your whole side back uh windows it's amazing so uh, I mean, everyone else will try to charge you 1200 and up. So I'm kidding you not. Take it to him. No BS. He's going to do a great clean work for you. He won't create those jagged edges. And his will roll all the way to the very top. Um, I wish I'd known about him prior to taking my car and getting it botched up at another place. I don't recommend them whatsoever. Uh, take it to Hamid. Sherman Oaks is worth the drive. Save yourself $600. And he was able to get me in right away. I mean, you know, when I was there, he was doing at least probably, I'd say, about a dozen cars lined up. He got them all done within two hours. That's how much cars you can get. Most shops will take a whole day for them to be able to get your car done, prepping and everything like that. But when you have a team like he does, uh, you know, time is money. He gets in and out. So he was able to fully utilize his team effectively. They were just so professional. Some of them been working with him for almost 19 years. I kid you not, almost two decades they've been with him. Uh, the average person's been there for at least five plus years. You know, some have been there for 14 years, but 19 years, over a decade, some of them. So for the most of them, actually. So it's pretty good service. It gets you in and out. He was able to squeeze me in. Uh, I wasn't expecting I was just going down south to get some Korean taco like I always do. And I said, you know what, let me hit him up. See if he's going to be open. Surely enough, he said, if you can make here by 5, schedule me in at 3. Got me out exactly about 5 o'clock. Uh, he, he took his time. He even checked it out because he realized it came from such a far distance, you know, 6 hours away. And uh, he really took care of me. Um, so I don't think I see the orange peel texture anymore. It's not orange color. It's just the peel texture I was worried about. So we're going to take it for a drive down the Bay Area and we'll find out. Look at that. It says it blocks up to 98%. This is 70%. It's not legal. I just want to let you guys know that. Recommend for off-road usage. Uh, but it's rare that they'll pull you over to ticket you. I'd rather just get a ticket if I'm going to deal with my skin treatment from the sun. I just don't want to, you know, get any kind of skin cancer. I'd rather <laughs> protect myself, you know. Um, but it's visible enough where you can see even at dark time. I drove this car at nighttime at 70%. And it's still the same as what it was. And also creates a really nice look, like a stealth look to it. So I recommend he offers 3M. He does pretty much all kinds. But uh, I stick with uh, Expel because they are my paint protection film. Uh, I have the Ultimate uh, Expel paint protection film. Now I got the XR Plus uh, pretty much around my whole car, including the front windshield here. So it's really nice.